hi guys welcome to this channel if you're new or welcome back if you're returning thank you so much for clicking on this video i really really appreciate it now in this week's video you are going to spend time with me or spend few days with me without a nanny yes and as you can see on on the video uh, i started off by folding clothes yeah this is one of the tasks that i struggled with the most i just struggled with this one for real i could do uh, could wash clothes and then just pile them pile 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 <laughs> until i just de decide eh, now zimekuwa mob so i just do some folding yeah so that's what i'm continuing doing and as i do that in case you're wondering why i needed a nanny yes i needed a nanny because i gave birth barely two weeks to my final qualifying exam and um I obviously needed help yeah and uh, i just decided to also move with the nanny on this side because um uh, just in case the results uh, did not come uh, well <laughs> as it didn't <laughs> I could e easily just go back with her to school and she could continue just uh, staying with me and a baby yeah so that's why I needed her and this week she had left to visit her kids so I just had to survive yeah so yeah just spend few days with me get some tips also if you have any tips that uh, any first time mom can use um in order to get things done with the with the newborn or with the baby you can just leave them on the comment section down below so that we can teach it each other yeah also i'm recording this on a very early sunday morning <laughs> and as you all know uh, there are churches everywhere so in case you hear um background noise i apologize so yeah i started this vlog on a sunday evening yeah and also as i continue folding these clothes let me just take this ch chance to thank uh all of you 75 subscribers for watching my content and subscribing to it <laughs> yo yo i really really appreciate it okay i do not take that for granted and if uh, this video convinces you to subscribe please subscribe and i'll really appreciate you so yeah this point the little one had woken up and i had to uh, stop and attend to him a bit before i could continue i'm telling you by the time i was done folding these clothes <laughs> well the struggles anyway yeah so guys this is the progress so here are all the clothes that are folded our clothes then these ones need to be put on hanger hangers and some of our inner wares that i will sort out later and then we have baby stuff on this tool so 
after folding i organized the clothes in the respective places and i gave uh, the little one a shower yeah so at this point i was just uh, planning to get him dressed <music> Now, I do not know if it is just my little one who gets fuzzy and cranky anytime I put clothes on him. It's crazy. I do not know when <laughs> he'll get used to wearing clothes. Like, he cries his lungs out and <laughs> putting on clothes on him usually takes even close to an hour because you just it's a struggle it's a struggle so if you have the same experience with me just comment down below let me know what you do different yeah Let me give you first time moms an advice whenever you go shopping for these rompers please if you can just get zip ones <laughs> just get the zipped ones because these uh, tic tacs will just <laughs> will give you a bad experience with your baby gosh especially if you have a fuzzy one like mine whenever it's time to put on clothes you will hate you will hate this this part of your life okay so just get zipped ones they are easy you just put it on baby and just up yeah so just avoid avoid at all cost if you can these tic tacs yeah i mean you can even hear him crying <laughs> so loud like in a kwanga to fight too. washing baby now it was time to make supper so this night i was making beef and ugali yeah uh what were greens najua najua <laughs> najua but at this time we just decided to just take beef and ugali like it's uh, like evil too okay so yeah and um later on you'll see uh the hub helped me uh finish cooking because for obvious reasons yeah and i had to take care of the little one the ugali that you'll also see us cooking it's a mixture of maize flour and cassava flour so yeah it was from my mother-in-law's uh hall so that's why uh that's why i'm tawana it's not wimby uh yeah so so good morning guys um today is on a monday and i'm sorry i look like this but i'm just taking up right now so it's around uh, 10 24 a.m 
so literally we've not had any sleep last night it was so crazy sorry for my crappy look i feel like i'll always be apologizing for my crappy look guys i'm so sorry i'm just from waking up 10, 15 minutes ago we did not sleep guys i'm telling you if you are planning to be a mother first time mom especially guys there is no sleep for you the moment you get pregnant you forget about sleep <laughs> even my partner uh has not yet gone to work right now uh it's when he's preparing to leave i'm telling you this baby has been fuzzy the whole night i mean what i don't know what's wrong we've given all the colic medicines guys i'll show you we use all the colic medicines in this house but they just don't seem to work so i want to i was supposed to wake up in the morning <laughs> very early but i couldn't i was just beat i was so tired to even wake up so i just want to get him to have a shower then go bask in the sun a little bit then uh, i'll talk to you guys when i can after shower time it's now basking time and he hates basking a lot so what i do to help him contain the sunlight i swing him uh, also just to calm him down so that he can able he can be able to relax also i also turn him to on his back so that his back can also get some of the sunlight yeah um hmm, so how do you put your baby to bask under the sun well i have gotten a lot of advice <laughs> from different people who've had kids some of them will tell me put your baby uh strip stripped naked uh some will tell you put only diaper some will tell you just have the vest on like it's a lot just expose the legs how do you do yours i'm confused so i just put him uh with uh, sometimes a vest or a onesie and a diaper on so how do you do yours let's educate each other down below in the comment section it's like a few hours later um it's almost 12 noon right now uh it's when the baby has now like um, slept <sighs> and i feel relieved i feel like i want to also sleep with uh, uh, i feel like also want to sleep with the baby but who is gonna do this house chores guys who's gonna do this house chores if i sleep i mean sleeping when baby sleeps is sometimes not practical but again sometimes it is okay so don't get me wrong but uh if you can get rest if you can get rest just 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 dive into it okay just rest rest okay yeah so i want to make breakfast imagine right now i want to make breakfast my partner already left for work like an hour ago i want to make breakfast i want to clean up like this house is a mess it's so mess it's a mess but i don't have a lot of dishes good thing i usually cook as i go i clean when i cook i clean as i go yeah if it makes sense so and I, the first thing I want to do is to take tea because if I don't, I'll take tea uh, at around 5 p.m. and it's not healthy. I, I've been struggling with breakfast for the longest, for the longest. I usually just have late breakfast and it's, I don't know what to do about it to be honest, yeah. So this is one of those days that I, um, I woke up so late because baby baby did not literally sleep he started sleeping like okay yesterday after washing him he slept around 11 and woke up at 12 midnight slept for one hour from then baby has not slept up to 5 a.m you guys you can imagine it was chaotic it was stressful it was we had a roller coaster of emotions in this house let me tell you guys hey how my postpartum has been i'll come back with a video on that and guys it's a real story time <laughs> just what if you're not subscribed you better subscribe now so that that story does not uh leave you out okay thank you <laughs>
after cleaning up just as i was to serve my tea I realized I did not have a squat so I just had to go to the shop and get mandazis for breakfast yeah so that's me going to buy the mandazis <laughs> So I've just been resting the whole day. I did nothing else from when you saw me taking, uh, making that tea. I did not do anything else. I just took tea, and I just decided to just rest. Like my body shut down completely. It just shut down. It just couldn't, and I just couldn't force it. I was tired. So. I'm just resting with the baby. Uh, when he sleeps, I sleep. When he wakes up, I'm up. When he sleeps, I'm sleep. When he naps, let me say napping. <laughs> Makes sense. So even right now, he's napping. Uh, he's still a nap right now. It's napping. And I want to put him on a routine somehow. But I don't know how I'll do it. I don't know how I'll do it, but I, 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 I gotta do it. Okay, I wanna put him on a routine that said that wake up at this time, naps around this time, and that and that kind of thing. Maybe to help calm him down in the night time. 
anyway let me stop ranting so enough of the rest uh anything else that uh, remained to be done uh will be done this night before tomorrow because tomorrow i have guests i'm hosting uh, my family and um part of my family i don't want to wake up in that rush like, oh my god i need to wash utensils i need to cook i need to mop no 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 so that when i wake up tomorrow it's just cooking and waiting for guests okay i don't think i'll put you guys on uh as i cook i'll just show you as i eat <laughs> and i'll show you my plate later on it's now cleaning and organization time and uh, as i continue doing that i just wanted to uh, explain to you how my day usually goes on so what happens is that i usually prefer to do my house chores most of it the cleaning the organization the mopping the the washing of the dishes i do i usually prefer to do them at night time yeah so that in the morning probably i can just uh do the washing of the clothes and i just get to rest the rest of the day yeah so but sometimes it usually does not happen like that because sometimes i'm tired yeah sometimes i'm just bored to do it i just sometimes i just want to bond with uh, the little one so it does not usually happen a uh, hundred percent of the time but i usually try at least 75 percent of the whole week i do my work uh, uh, most of the night time yeah but sometimes also when nimelemewa <laughs> kabisa you know there are those times una bembeleza mtoto the whole night ukiamka hata you are tired unataka tu ku relax you know uh, so that's where the hub steps in god bless him for me he just uh, he does where he can and just leaves the rest yeah so that i can be able to handle it whenever i, I feel more energetic to do them yeah so i can just also uh help you in that routine <laughs> if you're a first time mom yeah so just try and do your chores just how you can don't overstretch but ile tu unaweza do it in the night time so that uh, in the morning you have very little to accomplish and so that you can have rest you know when you really need so much rest <laughs> especially when you're breastfeeding because that's the only way you'll be able to also produce milk you know it all starts from the brain so you just have to get organized from your brain okay so that you can also um you can also stimulate milk let down okay yeah so that's that uh, here i was just cleaning the room after all after that i'll mop the, the african in me got me <laughs> got me wiping that stool with that uh how the pillowcase the ghetto <laughs> don't judge me <laughs> that was the nearest thing i saw yeah so i was just organizing the room then i'll mop it then i'll clean the uh, sitting room which i'll not show you because it's dark and then um i'll f i'll not finish by the <laughs> I did not finish doing everything. I did not. Uh, I think I only mopped the kitchen and I just left every other situation just like that. Yeah, and finished the next morning. So, yeah. If you're enjoying the video up to this point, please like the video, comment anything, subscribe if you haven't already, and share my content to anyone you feel like this content will help. Thank you.
morning guys from my kitchen uh, like i already told you guys i didn't manage to do everything that i wanted to do in the night because i was beat i was beat and i couldn't just force my body anymore also when i wanted to finish up the hub arrived and uh, it just had to stop I had to stop and uh, we spent some time together as baby was sleeping, we ate and by the time baby was waking up, uh, I just felt no, it's okay, I'll just wake up uh, in the morning and just finish. So yeah, that's what happened and I woke up uh, at around 8 today morning, it's on a Tuesday. I washed uh, some clothes, I'll show you in a bit. Now I want to hang them. I haven't done anything else, by the way. I haven't even taken breakfast or anything. Plus, I told you I have guests. Obviously, obviously, everything is messy. I'll show you around. Uh, my my living room is my sitting room is the only place that looks a bit organized. But my bedroom and my kitchen is the ghetto hood. So I want to clean up. Uh, but of course, I'll mop again the whole house too yeah so um what i want to do first before baby wakes up i want to go do some shopping what i want to cook today i don't think i'll show you guys as i cook i'll just show you what i want to cook or rather i'll even show you the last uh the outcome of the food yeah <laughs> cooking, is, cooking is not my favorite thing but when i do i make sure i make sure guys <laughs> yeah so um, let's do that uh let me show you just the situation around the house now guys before i show you around the house i just wanted to create an awareness over here that uh if you're a mom or if you're someone who takes care of uh, someone's child please never never leave that child unattended okay from experience guys this day i left to the market to go and get food stuff that i wanted to cook for my guest guys i took around 15 to 20 minutes uh out so when i came back i had left my baby sleeping so when i went and came back uh normally i tell my good neighbor to just so when i went and uh, so when i came back sorry i found my baby crying like he'd cried dry like alikwamelia amekaukiwa ames wet akona joto mdomo imejamate nika ime form a form like eh hey, 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 that was an ex a scary experience i'd never want to to uh, to experience again like alikuwa ameisha hadi sauti it was crazy i felt so bad niliangusha tu kila kitu hata nilikuwa nimeshika niliangusha hapo tu kwa mlango nikaenda tu kumchukua cause we i wondered kwani for how long did this child cry i didn't kanza ku google i googled so for what's the normal hours or minutes that a baby can cry what can cry cause to a, a, a small baby a young baby sorry like where it was chaotic then hata vitu nilikuwa nimeenda kutafuta sikupata so i was like sita ningeoja tu sister yangu akuje ndio a uh, nini ndio aniangalie mtoto niende so guys um, nimembeba <laughs> utasikia masauti don't worry so guys just be careful do not do not leave your child unattended at any point doesn't matter if he can walk does not matter if an, an howezi roll does not matter if he cannot get or she cannot get herself out of bed please just don't leave your baby unattended it's bad it's so bad thank you so this is the situation on my sink these are just dishes that we used in the night and these ones i managed to wash yesterday there's nothing the floors are a bit clean because they have i think did some touch up then that's the situation oh my gosh that's uh give me for yesterday uh, supper and then uh the clothes that i made to um to do what to hang then baby is sleeping on the couch and that's my living room it's a bit organized i know and then my bedroom 
uh, this water baby used to shower and then my bed oh gosh and <laughs> tell me why tell me why i fix that net like that tell me why tell me why but there's nothing i can do it does the job but i can't recommend it for long i will actually change it yeah it tears and then mosquitoes also get their way inside yeah uh, inside the net so you can imagine sometimes so yeah and we do we have a situation on these walls that's because this house does not come with the um, wardrobe but it's fine it's fine we work out we work with what we have so yeah that's the situation of um this room so that said i just wanna do the cleaner uh the clothes that you've seen those ones the baby clothes those ones they are clean so they just need some folding allow me to be the superwoman that i am <laughs> have you guys seen that video where uh someone acts as a woman who has given birth as a mom let me say as a mom so what happens at the when the baby sleeps the woman tends to be a like an aqua superwoman like I'm talking to a killer like you like you want to and you're done which is so true when your baby sleeps that's the time you want to do everything so I think I'll just go to the shop first I don't think I'll come with you today because I want to be swift then after that I'll come back hang the clothes and do the cleaning so guys I'm behind the camera my son is not cooperating, so my guest will do the haul for you guys, okay? Say say hi. Hi. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, so I bought um what chat one minji. Yeah. Yeah, I want to like mix it na rice. And then we have this uh fruit here. Uh watermelon. Next. Uh -huh. Uh, it's a bag of fruits here. We have uh, so I watched this TikTok on today on fruit salad, and I want to try it here. Yeah? So this is uh, pineapple, pineapple. Uh, we have popo. Um, we have two bananas. We have. Uh, have passion mm, passion we have uh, carrot oh, yeah. we have one mango I added watermelon for some reason and then uh, beetroot yeah so then we have soda here and this oil I bought it because I want to like fry fish for my sister. So the fish is. Let me bag it up. So. So story of this fish. My sister requested that I cook him, cook her fish. Sorry, cook her fish. So I just went and bought. At this time, it's around two. At this time. Most people have not started like uh, frying the fishes. So I just got it like this, then I want to fry. So yeah, and I had like uh, this one, curry powder. Then my sister, this sister who has come, is very minimal on open the spices, isn't it? Mm -hmm. open I puke. <laughs> We have this fishery rice over here, <laughs> three quarter, <laughs> and we have uh, what do we call this one? Lemons. lemons, lemons. Yeah. So you want to cook, and because my baby is acting up, I want her to help me because why? <laughs> hey, motherhood. I uh, I don't think I'll show you guys the cooking process, but I'll uh, finish at the end product. Okay. See you guys. Guys, progress, progress, fish. And we have guys, I'm holding my son as I'm doing this. So, you bear with the dancing of the camera. We have chicken by the way, so for Nyesha, Kenyan chicken. 
Ndiyo inafaa kuwa crunch kiasi Progress, progress So guys, imagine my sister is telling me Ati she's a guest, she's not supposed to be good Yes But now, my son is acting up So ni fanye guys The book comment down below Ha 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 So guys, this is the progress. Our chicken is ready. Uh, we have our rice here. And we have fish for my sister because... Because... He insist, she insisted, she insisted, yeah? So, we just want to serve now. And then I'll show you everything all together. This was pure slappage, please. I wish you could all have a taste of it. <laughs> hey guys, I hope you're well. If you've reached this far, thank you so much. I really, really appreciate you. You are amazing. Be blessed. So I want to um, close off this vlog. But before I do, sorry if the vlog was a little bit everywhere so yeah that's how i spent uh, my few days without a nanny and up to now my nanny is not back yet it's now a week plus and i don't think she'll be coming back yo it's a lot it's a lot but i'll come back with the story time so please subscribe <laughs> and like the video okay yeah so I hosted my sister, there are supposed to be two sisters, but my other sister couldn't make it because of engagements. Uh, but all in all, I had fun, we made stories, like yo, it was like a year, actually a year, uh, having not met my, uh, this, my sister, um, who came today so it was so nostalgic i loved the moment it was great we cooked to it we laughed <laughs> it was a lot yeah and i had so much fun so uh thank you so much sis i know you're watching this thank you so much for passing by i really really i appreciate you for taking your time to come so that's that so today i was supposed to take my son for his next job so i didn't make it because obviously for obvious reasons yeah so i'll just take him tomorrow i just thought that i'll close this vlog here and start another one yeah yeah because i didn't want it to be so long so that's what happened i don't think i'll be doing anything much tonight maybe I'll just wash up and rest so yeah so thank you so much for sticking around if these are the kind of videos that you enjoy watching please subscribe to my channel share 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 widely so that my community can grow yeah so thank you so much for sticking around i really appreciate you and see you on the next one bye guys <laughs>